well, you know, first of all, we're happy to get the three points, but I think it's probably one of our most tactically indisciplined games that we've played. Uh, we were fortunate to get the first uh, couple goals in the first half. Probably could have had a couple more, but we didn't take them. Uh, and then we came back out the second half. Um, you know, I warned them at, at halftime, just because they're, the other teams are man down, you don't take the foot off the gas. You don't stop playing our game. And it seemed to me that we just got into their game, where they were just hitting it long, and then we decided when we got it, we weren't going to play. Even though we had the extra man, we were still trying to go long, and that's, that's not our style. All right? We don't have a big forward that could hold the ball up for us and, 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 and get win flick-ons and stuff like that. So we have to play. We like to play through the middle. And even with the man up, we still just refuse. You know, the three guys in the middle were caught on the same side of the ball every time, and, and we don't play like that. We play, we have better space than that when we play normally. Even on this pitch, being a small pitch, but uh, tonight just, you know, and I, I'll talk to him. Uh, you know, we're happy for the victory, but, you know, we have to play better. We have to play our brand of soccer, and kicking it long, is, that's not our style. And I thought we got into that a little bit, and they were just, even with the man down, winning all the knockdowns and coming at us, and, you know, that stupid throwing is effective and, and it worked for them and you know but all in all you know I'm happy for the victory but we have to play better soccer we have to stay more disciplined and and, and continue to do whatever you know it is that that, that we do. Um, Olsen came in and made a few created a few chances right away uh, missed the breakaway uh, opportunity but then he scores in the 90th minute what do you think that says about kind of his mental strength to be able to put that miss behind him and well, I, to be honest, I think he had no choice but to make that, you know, I mean, uh, he missed that breakaway, um, you know, that's why I put David in the game, you know, I thought David could help us get some possession back and just keep the ball a little more, you know, and you know, because he's a very technical player, uh, I'm happy that he was so technical on that finish, uh, you know, thought he should have had the first run on the breakaway, but, you know, th those things happen, but, you know, he redeemed himself in the 90th minute, uh, so so that was good for us, good for the team, and it shows, it does show some, some mental toughness to, you know, forget about the last one and, and, and make amends on, on that second opportunity that he got. But I'm very disappointed with the goals that we took. Um, you know, it's just, uh, it's our mistakes. You know, our mistakes that led to those things. You know, even the PK, it comes from someone trying to dribble. We lose and they're getting down on the counter attack. And uh, we just went away from our game a bit tonight. And I'm, I'm, I'm very disappointed in that. Uh, we'll, we'll address it a little bit tonight, but definitely in training tomorrow, we'll, we'll, we'll talk more about it in details. and because we have to play better soccer than that. We were fortunate after being up 2-0 at, at half to come back and win the game, you know, and that's at home, that's, that's, that's not good.